Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to this late night edition of the Death by Cold Steel Report. I'm your host, Seattle206723. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Uh, Gersin Perry of uh, York County, south of uh, Charlotte, North Carolina, woke up to a sword going into her belly. And uh, it was by her estranged husband who snuck into the home. Uh, breaking and entering, and he had a sword with him, uh, Philip Perry, uh, and she fought back. The sword almost pierced through to the other side. Um, she she fought with him and uh, pulled the sword out of her body, um, cutting her hand. So this was a very sharp sword. He wasn't playing, folks. Um, we got the most wicked uh, people in the world when a person is safe in their own home. I mean, you I've covered the stories of uh, New Jersey, uh, a.k.a. Hello on Earth, where they're sneaking into homes and cutting kids' throats at night. I mean, this is what's going on out there in the world. Uh, Philip Perry was being held in the uh, Mouse, uh, Mouse Justice Center in York County. He's being held without bond, charged with attempted murder. Uh, Gersin said she felt like she felt like a nightmare. It began with her strange uh, husband who had, when he broke into her house, and she thought she was, you know, was dreaming this. Uh, believe me, it wasn't a dream, especially when that sharp pain of that sword hit. Uh, she quote, I really thought I was in one of those lifetime movies because I never thought it would happen to me, said uh, Gersin Perry. Uh, she fought back. He said he was going to kill her after he had plunged the sword through her. Um, it's a miracle that this woman lived. Um, six inches and up and to the right, that's through the heart. Um, a swift cut down onto the neck, and you behead a person, you know. Um, it's like the immortals in the streets of... Uh, Vancouver. I mean, you got people cutting off people say, because they think they're conquerors. I mean, they're, they're out to conquer people. Um, that is the uh, the truth of the matter. When someone takes a sword to another person, it's an act of conquering you um, or slaying you. Um, I consider a, a, a sword to the heart, to the chest area as, as being slain. Someone takes your head off, you've been conquered. And just so you can see the definition, to, the word conquer, to defeat or subdue by force, especially by force of arms. For those who like to post down and uh, send private emails about the details of some of these reports. Um, she's quoted as saying, I ended up stopping him, but keep him from stabbing me completely through. In her words, it almost went all the way through her. And I said, uh, what are you doing? He said, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> no, no freaking, you know, crap, lady. He's just plunged a sword into you. Uh, relatives were both and called 911. She said, I was finally able to get out of the bed, get the sword up out of, my, uh, out of me. And that's how I cut my fingers. And I was blocking him, and I ended up getting, the, getting him away from me, said uh, Perry. So she's fighting for her life. Uh, Perry took off walking down the street. Deputies quickly found him and arrested him, uh, the police are saying. So they're out in the county. He's sneaking around in the bushes uh, with a sword. I mean, if he takes the woman's head off, does he expect her body to raise up into the air and, you know, he absorbs the energy or, you know, <laughs> unbelievable. Um, and, of course, he's being held uh, without bond. In, uh, in jail. He, he ain't getting out, folks. I can tell you that for sure. Unbelievable. And I talk a lot about getting, you don't want a sword to your belly. Uh, this woman's going to have bowel movement problems, uh, eating disorders. It's just going to go on and on. Well, I'm going to post links to these to this uh, particular article that I, I wanted to share with you. I've been watching this story for about three days now. Um, this is the first time the complete story is broken. Um, 
and the details were kind of scanty, saying that she was attacked that night was uh, some of the uh, earlier stories. It's finally been updated to give the full story. So that way we could, uh, I could really break it down for you and give an idea, give you an idea. I mean, this, and there's a picture of him in the video. He's sneaking around at night through the woods in the county side. This ain't in the city, folks. This is in the county, um, in a rural area. And he's sneaking into homes and plunging swords into people. My God. Well, this is Seattle 206723, folks, uh, with the Death by Cold Steel report. Uh, but before we go out, I want to go to uh, Blade Aim. Uh, he posted a uh, post on my uh, landlord uh, plunges sword into a tenant uh, video, and I appreciate the, the post and the uh, and the comments very much. Thank you. Uh, Move along, he says. These are the ones that got caught, of course. Clowns to the left of me, jokers to the right. One never knows if they're t talking to a person with who's playing with a full deck. Civilization seems to be held together by a thin illusion of control. And that is very, very true. As any, and he says, as your channel continues to grow, you ought to consider doing jailhouse interviews with the subjects of your videos from behind a three thick, three inch thick uh, plexiglass, of course. <laughs> well, but I uh, thank you very much for those those comments and uh, for those suggestions because I, 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 we're definitely headed in that direction. Um, it is an illusion. Um, the control mechanisms that are in place. I mean, they talk about guns. I prefer, like I said many times, I prefer to be shot than have someone stick a sword through me. <laughs> I'd probably end up like uh, uh, Duncan off of a Highlander. I, I'd be frozen in that position when he ran into the uh, to the Cougar, uh, to the Kurgan. Um, unbelievable. Um, and I talk about a sword. You don't want a sword to your belly. And now we've got a woman with a sword to her belly. Well, it's the Seattle 206723 folks with the Death by Cold Steel report. Um, please rate. Please comment. Uh, please share the videos. And we're out.